What up, G-Life? It's your boy MC Shadow back at you with another video. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, check out the playlist. The playlist where I have all my videos in their own folders makes the video you're looking for a lot easier. And don't forget to click on the subscribe and the like. It's free. It don't cost anything. You'll be helping my channel out a lot. So, if you could please do me the favor and right now, you know, tap on the subscribe or the like. Help, help me out, brother. Help me out. Um, now, what I wanted to talk about was actually, um, you know, one of the problems that I see, you know, that occurs a lot now, you know, nowadays more than ever. Um, and it is a problem. You know what I mean? Um, like, for example... I work, I have a job, you know what I mean? I have a decent job. Um, I have a home, you know what I mean? Uh, I have a house, a car and stuff like that. Um, now I'm not here to brag or, 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 or none of that um, because um, those are all material things, they, they mean nothing. Um, but I'm saying money, just because you have money doesn't make you better than the next person. It's just a piece of paper. That's it, that's all it is. It really doesn't hold no actual value uh, money only holds as much value as you know society gives it um, you know what I mean um, because they're forcing you to pay for something that is naturally yours you know that should naturally be yours since since birth which is you know home and food and water um, but yeah they feel like they need to charge you for it for what reason I have no idea I have no idea who gave these people the land the water the food and everything like that to have people to force them to uh, you know you know, work in order to receive something that should naturally be theirs, like every other creature in the world. But that's neither here nor there. Um, so it's just a piece of paper. And I notice a lot of things that people do is like when they're arguing, or when they're trying to stick their 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 message across, or just because they have money feels like they're entitled that they're better than you. That that whatever they say is right. That they can't be wrong just because they have money. And that's always the main comeback. Shut up, fool. I, I, I got racks. Man, you can't talk, man. Look, look at this watch, homie. You can't be saying nothing. You can't be saying nothing. Just because you have money and everything like that doesn't mean you're you're not making mistakes. Doesn't mean that just because this person doesn't have the, the type of money you have doesn't mean that he could give you some wisdom or some or some words of encouragement. Uh not not to financially build yourself up, but to Build yourself up as a person because you're spiraling out of control. And like I said, you could lose all of that. You know what I mean? They're just materialistic things. You know what I mean? Uh, you know, and if you slip up and next thing you know, you're going to end up losing it all and end up uh, having nothing. You know what I mean? So some words of encouragement don't hurt uh, or wisdom. You know what I mean? I know sometimes we feel like, you know, we have it all, especially, you know, when we're getting riches and everything like that. We feel like we have everything under control. And sometimes that clouds us, you know. Uh, from seeing that we're maybe maybe spiraling out of control you know what i mean it happens a lot you know uh, one thing I, I find funny is that a lot of people say that they'll that they'll trade their life with these celebrities right because they think because these celebrities are rich and everything like that 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 they have the, the best lives in the world look at uh kanye west look at kim kardashian look at will smith look at robin williams look at prince look at michael jackson look at all of these people who who going through divorces and marriage after marriage after marriage after marriage and, and, and courtroom after courtroom after courtroom and, and losing custody of their kids and not even able to see their kids and and whoopty whoopty wa and then uh, you know having a problem with drug addiction, alcohol addiction, overdoses, suicides, you know, like the Beatles, uh, the the Kiss band, um, Robin Williams, uh, Prince, Michael Jackson. For heaven's sakes, they were drug addicts, you know what I mean? Um, they had a drug problem, you know what I mean? And obviously we know why we do drugs, you know, to escape uh, society because we don't like, you know, we don't like reality. So it's our, it's our form of escape. Uh, and they're the richest people and they don't like reality. Can you believe that? Yeah, that's because money is not everything. Money is nothing, bro. You know, it's, it's just because you have it doesn't make you better than the next person. Like I said, I live fine. And I don't think I'm better than nobody else in this world. That's why I never flossing and everything like that. And even when people be watching my videos and be like, What's up with that same shirt you're always wearing and blah, blah, blah. I don't care, bro. I live my own life. I run my own life. A lot of people think that they run their own lives. They don't. Society runs your life. You won't wear what you want to wear because you're afraid to get judged by, by the world. Therefore, you wear what you think the world will approve. Same thing with, uh, you know, uh, what kind of car you drive, what kind of 
from from where do you go to eat so what oh you go to that place that's ghetto and just because they say that now you're gonna stop going to that place oh you wear it oh you actually like those shoes that's your wife so now you're not gonna wear those even though you like them your society is literally running your life you're not running your life you have no control over your life all these people random strangers are conducting how you carry yourself what you wear what you eat what you dress and all of that see me on the other hand I wear whatever the hell I want eat whatever, and I do whatever the hell I want people be like oh that's ghetto uh, get a new shirt uh, bro hey look it doesn't bother me it, I'm, I'm comfy you know I know the next off hey, bro it doesn't bother me I, I'm cool with it and plus it's my work shirt so <laughs> but even if it wasn't it doesn't bother me so why would I go and get another one? You get what I'm saying? Um, once it starts bothering me, then I'll go, you know? But if it bothers other people, that's not that sounds like a personal problem. You get what I'm saying? So I don't let people conduct how I move. But a lot of people do. And that's the problem with society nowadays. A lot of people are actually scared to give their honest opinions or, or, or to actually be themselves because they're afraid of what the world might think of them. And that's why they play these facades where they're flashing all this money that's not theirs and jewelry and whoopty whoopty wah or they'd be like, shut up man, you see this? That that's always their that's always their their trump card. Man, shut up man, look at this money. Can't tell me nothing. Like that doesn't mean anything. What the hell does that mean? That those that's a piece of paper, bro. Money is not gonna make you smarter than me. It's not gonna make you stronger than me. It's not gonna make you faster, it's not gonna make you fly. It's not going to make you fart, you know, lasers. It's not going to do none of that. You know what I'm saying? Um, it's just a piece of paper, bro. So it doesn't make you better than the next man. Because it doesn't, you know, give you none of those abilities. In a sense, all it really gives you access to is to purchasing more materialistic things. And how does that make you better than the next man? My boy, he could have a Lamborghini and I could have a piece of shit Honda. If my... If our destination is, is Olive Garden, we're both going to get there. Yeah, he might get there faster, but we're both going to get there. And he paid like a million times more than what I paid for. Or let's say a watch, right? This watch is going to be able to tell me exactly the same time as his watch. Yet it costed a million times less. <laughs> I mean... I don't get it. Like, get what I'm saying? It's like, does that watch shoot rockets or what? That like, I don't. It tells time just like any other watch. Um, get what I mean? Um, you know, is this is this notion that that people create that makes you think just because you hold this item that you get to talk, you get to belittle people? Like, like I'm humble. Like I said, I live good, and you know. And it's successful, uh, but but why? But what gives me the right to rub it into other people's faces? Though I should be humble for what I got because I know the struggle and and, and I know how hard it was to obtain what I have. You know what I mean? Uh, because I know the battles and everything like that. You know that everybody goes through. So why would I shove it into their faces? You know what I mean? And acting like if I never came out of that place, or acting like if I don't know what that was, or, or acting like if I didn't come from that area. You know what I mean? Instead of helping, why am I, you know, making it more difficult? Just like how they made it more difficult for us. And even if they are being assholes about it, whatever, uh, why, why throw this this materialistic thing in their faces and and act and think that I'm better than these people? Even if they are being stupid, you know, aren't we supposed to be the bigger person? Aren't we supposed to be above the 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 antics and the gimmicks and all of that? But yet we're stooping down to their level. But yet we think that we're higher than them when we're stooping down to their their exact same tactics. Yet we think we're above them when we're doing the very exact same thing that they're doing. In a different matter, but we're still doing it. So just because you have money doesn't make you better than the next man. You know what I mean? You should be humble for what you got and not to be rubbing it into other people's faces. Um, and then act like you're a good person for it. You get what I'm saying? Um... But it's what a lot of people do. Is a lot of people think just because they have it, they can't be told nothing, or or that they can't be wrong. When that's not true. You get what I mean? Um, always humble yourself, because uh, it's not an easy battle. You know what I mean? For a lot of these individuals, you know, don't forget where you come from. Don't forget your roots. You know.
know what I mean? There's a lot of things. See, I have all this stuff, but it means nothing, you know. Um, my family means more to me. My kids, my wife mean more to me. Um, my morals mean more to me. Um, and, and the friendship that I have with my homeboys mean more to me. Because that's something that money can't buy. You know what I mean? People that were really there for you uh, through the hardest times and... and and all that that's something that money can't buy that's why if people could say whatever they want that that's stupid and all that they prefer having money yeah uh-huh look at all these people like with money like little wayne chris brown birdman uh all these individuals they have money yet they keep going to the ghettos and hanging around with these gang members some even join gangs already when they already made it like chris uh, uh chris brown and little wayne in them all that money in the world, yet they 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 choose to. And you see all these rappers celebrity. They choose to be, you know, right there amongst the the, because like I said, money's not gonna be able to buy that. That what they want, the respect. Because people, I'm telling you, people only get Gucci, Lamborghinis, uh, Versace, all of that because they know that everybody knows how much that costs. You know what I mean? They know that that is expensive, and that's what they're chasing. They're chasing. The idolization of, of society, a bunch of strangers. Because now you take it out, be, oh, he got money, he got money. And that's what people want. They want that recognition. It's not about the actual materialistic thing, it's about the recognition. They're looking for the approval of people they don't even know. And it's sad, bro. That strangers' opinions mean that much to you. That you're not that that you're not happy with yourself, that you need the approval of individuals in order to be happy with yourself. They have their morals in a different place. They always. Do. That's why you see a lot of these rich people. Their kids are are, you know, always in DUIs. They have drug problems. Um, they're all screwed up. You know what I mean? Because they're they're always at work and, and just neglecting their kids. And and there's more important things than money in this world, bro. You know what I mean? Um, I think it's sad that people don't realize it. You know, um, you know, it's good to be successful in this world. You know what I mean? Um, you know, but to a certain extent, you know, what are you going to be sacrificing? And is it worth that sacrifice? You know what I mean? Because uh, to me, uh, being there for my kids is going to be more important than, you know, you know, scoring a bag uh, on any given day. Um, but it's sad that world has it painted, painted uh, for individuals who want to be uh, chasing the bag instead because celebrities, rappers, all these people uh, stir it up that way because that's where these people get these ideas from about the shut up man I got money because they get it from these celebrities because that's what they do in order to shut up the, somebody they dislike so these people are just imit mimicking them you know what I mean um, they, said, they talk about a whole lot of like you know um, leading the right way and, and, and for the greater good or whatever but in reality they they're the ones that set a lot of the bad behaviors that be uh, polluting uh, society. Uh, you know what I mean? Um, it, and, that, and that's the honest truth about it. Um, you know, because they, they tend to do a lot of those stuff when they're, uh, how could I say, they're, um, you know, public figures, I guess you could say. Um, you know, because they tend to do that a lot. They do that a lot. Where they think that they can just be like saying that, oh, just because they have money that they don't make any errors and, and you know, and, and they're above you and stuff like that. Um, you know, when, like I said, there's there's more important things in this world than, than just money. You know what I mean? Um, you know, because, like I said, if success and riches really is the goal in life, if now you failed in life, then what was the goal in life before currency actually existed? That there was no point of life? Life was meaningless? I think people lost sight of what really matters in this world a long time ago because the uh, greedy, uh, corrupted, you know, and polluted the minds of individuals since way back. Uh, but I'm just saying, be humble. You know what I mean? Um, just because you got it doesn't make you better than the next man and uh, money isn't everything in this world you know what I mean uh, you should cherish you know family friends and your yourself morals but I'm just saying I'm shadow way out